The new stars is alpha 3.22 patch just hit the EPTU not too long ago. We're going straight into it. This one has a lot of bug fixes, but a few updates to features under the location. First and foremost, it says added star map records for derelict settlements. The next one is derelict settlement performance polished pass. This is good and increase crusader planet comma ray range to encompass all of the planet. That's interesting. Under gameplay, it says structural salvage VFX polished pass has also been done. Before I move forward, I'd like y'all to know that the channel goal for the end of this month is 10,000 subscribers. And if you watch content from this channel regularly, please do me a favor and hit the subscribe button. Under bug fixes, there's quite a few. The very first one is they fixed multiple place me balls around the new derelict settlement. They fixed an issue where the AI enemies slow to respond to player location and actions. It says please check one if possible and if you have any feedback and details hit up the regression thread. They also fix an issue where a player is intoxicated if the player takes off their helmet on first surface. I thought this was at only the derelict locations. It turns out it's uh, the entire planet. That's interesting. They fix an issue where the environmental ambience is inaudible at derelict settlements. They fix an issue where content of open or cargo containers does not transfer to ship. Generated loot box after the vehicle is destroyed. Okay. They also fix an issue where boss NPC does not spawn for elimination specific missions. They also fix an issue where in quantum traveling, the player can be left stranded in space and their ship will disappear. They fix an issue that allows players to stick cargo to the ceiling in their ship using the tractor beam. They also fix an issue where the center door are not responsive and all doors must be manually opened via the door panel in the Corsair. The fixing issue causing the failed negotiation mission with Claimer to be missing its interior. The fixing issue where the AI currents is not spawning. The also fixing issue causing gravelic bikes to not enter a landing state when powering off in gravity. The fixing issue causing Kovalev's personal retrieval missions not to appear. The fixing issue where the pilot seat remains fixed in place during ejection. And the fixing issue where the player might lose grip on the mounted gun immediately after ripping it. They fixed an issue where party invite notification has placeholder text in the subtext after sending the invite. They also fixed an issue in Arena Commander where during second round, the spawn barrier does not let player need spawn. They also fixed an issue where there are no repair or restock drops in game modes that have these drops. That's Pirate Swarm and Vandal Swarm. They fixed an issue causing missiles and bombs to the spawn much too quickly in the Radiant Commander and they also fixed an issue where certain HUD elements are doubled in the Radiant Commander along with this is 5 client crashes, 5 server crashes. Before I let you go, I'll let you all to know that my organization Phase 1 Industries is recruiting new and veteran players. If you are interested, you can find our Discord in the description down below. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, I'll see you on the next video.